This is a Desnav. Um, it can come on Android, but this is Windows CE 6.0. Works on earlier versions of Windows CE as well. Um, you have to pay for it, but it's a reasonable price. If you get UK maps, you're talking £17.76 I paid. And it's quite a nice looking system. A bit plain, obviously, but it, it's customizable anyway. But you've got your usual destination coordinates. You can do that, which probably won't use online search. Like if you if you got internet, then you can use that address. That and just come up. You choose your country. You click on the map, and then. It's I've only got UK and Ireland so it'll only come up with Ireland or UK anyway so put in your address as normal. Um route planner. Um that's giving you some things you've saved. Um history obviously. Services, I'm not sure whether I must do and use this but Internet connection. Well, we haven't got one, so that's not good. Uh, serial numbers, the numbers for uh, when you've purchased it. You could put things in favourites, obviously. You've got your place of interest. So your settings, there's lows in here. You've got root settings. Um, obviously, there's not, no root set, so you can't really do nothing here. Yeah, there you go. Right, map. You got map lists that gives you a list of the ones you own. Uh, favorites, obviously. Labels. I'm not sure what that is. Point of interest. I suppose you can just change things. 3D objects. You have got signpost lane assist. 3D buildings. Um. Obviously, you got your signal. That's for your GPS. That's that, and then there's all your satellite information, GPS. I don't think you can do anything with it. I think it automatically does everything for you. Right, uh, let's have a look at that. All oh, right, okay. So you can actually configure it. Auto configure, or you can set it. I didn't actually set it, but how it came to that conclusion, I don't know. But it works, so that's fine. Right, let's go back. Right, so now we got um we did the map appearance. You can change the day night mode map styles um backlight menu layout rotation uh, it's going to map styles you can choose different sort of color uh, schemes not bassy, falsy, monty, conti and ponty. Um backlight Day and night, you can choose the range of how uh, how lit up it is. Um, alerts that's your speed thing, so you can set the tone, you can change it as loads of options in it. I just go on and on. There you go. Interest of the uh, speed cameras. Right, just come back. Um, regional settings that's your language and your time and your units. Um, I know we there's sound. Oh, we done. There's your volume. You can auto adjust it. Mute. You can use Bluetooth. Not sure why you'd use Bluetooth. Um, Voice, that's the voice you can choose. Obviously, you've got a list there. You can change it. And about software version. Well, there's not much else really I can show you on here. It does load quite quickly, and it is, um, it is, um, quite good. Let's try something. 
Okay. Don't know what I pressed there, but. There you go, and there's your display. You've got how many miles it is, how long it's going to take, what time it is now. I put, yeah, that's now time, and that's what time you'll arrive. Right, I think that's pretty much it, really. And when you come in here, it's easy to get out, you just quit. There we go, job done. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, it's new software to me, it's changing it from what I had on there, so uh, it seems okay so far, so I'll give it a couple of days testing and see how I'll go with it.